Hi, I'm Adam Caboni. Jesse Caboni. And we're here with you today to talk about the Memorial Round that's coming up this Saturday. It starts at 2 o'clock and we're going to midnight, folks, so come out and dance. Yeah, it starts with a pipe ceremony, feast, so bring your feast bundles. Uh, potluck, too, if you want to bring a dish, your favorite dish to feast your uh, loved ones that have gone on before us. Come dance with them, eat, the, eat with them, make your favorite plate, and come have a good time. The singing will start that shortly after the feast. We'll begin with our uh, opening song, then we'll pass it out to our invited singers on the list. I believe there's eight of them coming from all over Turtle Island and our area to share their songs with us so we can dance with our loved ones. Yeah, and the singing is open to everybody, so uh, I think we got a guaranteed 15 spots, the registered singers that could register after, and we got a list of good singers from all over the place. Yeah. Very good volume, good songs. Come enjoy it. If you got a drum, bring a drum. Bring it out. Share with share with the community your voice, your sound. Back in the late 90s, uh, my, my uh, drum brothers, uh, the Anscombs, had um, lost their mom, and uh, and over a period of time, they they um, looked for methods of grieving process and to help the family within uh, within through that. And being a traditional family uh, of the drum and they wanted to help each other in a good way and so they sought out our friends from the west from um, Saskatchewan and Alberta um, some of our brothers from out there from the Red Bull singers uh, Joe Patagan, um, Melvin Stone just to name a couple, and uh, they they offered to come and help with run a memorial round dance for the Mianskum family. And initially, the the round dance was done in uh, Nipsing First Nation, as a, a couple of the brothers live there within the North Bay area. And um, so that's where the and it was kind of a centralized location as well for them. And um, so they brought their family together and they had the original round dance there and, um, for their family. And this is how it has come to be from within this area. And being a brother to them um, through singing and the drum, they, um, they invited me over. Um, so I went and I watched and I participated. My wife, as well, came with me, and and we we discussed on our way home that you know this would be something nice for the community to have as well. So we started looking into it, and this is uh, through the health center. Um, my wife was the health director, and we looked at bringing the round dance here, and this is where it's this is going to be the third year now. And um, we're bringing back Joe Patagan to come and assist us again for the third year and teach us some more and and help the community through the grieving process. We're taught with the grieving after you lose the loved one is that you you give up certain things and then in this this round dance is bringing you back into the circle, telling you it's okay to participate again. And that's that's part of all part of our growing and healing process. Ani, uh, Roxanne, uh, Reckley, Dishnikos. I wanted. I'm here to talk about um, the round dance, the memorial round dance. So we are in year three, and uh, and I'm here to share about um, part of the round dance. Uh, that is the healing part and you know organizing a lot of different activities for our community um, the round dance is something that 
has a lot of meaning for m for myself personally. I've did a lot of learning and I'm here to share on how it helped me in my healing process and my grieving process. You know, so uh, this is, like I said, three years and um, last year was a time where I had an opportunity to uh, dance and um, and remember my mom and dad. So what I had um, brought was a picture from that hangs in my kitchen. And it's a picture of my mom and dad, you know. Uh, they were f newly married. It was a picture of their wedding. Um, and then beside it was a picture of their 25th anniversary. So when they took a trip together. So it was a picture of my mom and dad. And that's who I wanted to um, think about and remember and dance for last year. So as part of the Memorial Round Dance, um, you can bring a, p a picture. And that's the picture that I had chosen, was a picture of my mom and dad. And beside me were other people in the community that brought their pictures of their family members. Um, I had uh, community members that had brought pictures of their grandparent, or their grandmom, their granddad, and um, their, their, their moms, you know, and their dads. And it could be a picture, you know, that you have on the wall. It could be the memorial mass card. Um, we even had someone who had, had a picture on their cell phone. The part was that we were dancing together and remembering the, the, our loved ones that, we, that were missing and that have passed on onto spirit world. So it is a powerful dance and you can feel the emotion as we're all dancing together, remembering our loved ones. And you will hear the names that the MC will announce of all the community members that passed on as well. And you'll say, oh yeah, I remember, you know, this past year we had um, so-and-so had passed on, or, you know, a couple of years ago, so-and-so passed on and, and we remember them. And that's, that's why we have this dance, is to remember our loved ones. Because when you lose someone, you kind of, when you're in that grieving process, you are caught up in the emotion where you know, you're afraid to talk about the person because it brings up a lot of pain for yourself. So when, when we have that dance together, it's okay that we talk about our loved ones because that's what, how we celebrate their lives, you know, and we're celebrating with dance, we're celebrating with food, which is why the memorial dance is, the round dance is so special. We, we talk about all the good times that we've had, you know, um, so in that essence, that's how it is, uh, promotes healing and wellness is through song and dance. And when you listen to the sound of the drum, it just gives you some peace of mind that they are in a good place. They are with Creator. So, so I invite you all to come and participate in the Memorial Round Dance. Hope to see you there. Miigwech.